What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to another vlog. So, I've got some chicken thighs that need to be taken off the stove. I got some rice. And then, I've got some ground turkey that I have to go ahead and cook. So, ground turkey's done. Um, I'm actually gonna pick up this video tomorrow just because it's already 11 o'clock I need to cut my hair and I need to go to bed because I have to open the gym tomorrow but I'm gonna be talking to you guys about my diet uh, what I'm gonna be doing now for my training how I'm trying to take my physique to the next level and basically just catching you guys up on everything uh, with my training since I've been trying to get my life settled here lately but I'm gonna go ahead and catch some Z's I'll catch you guys in the next clip good night remember drop a like on the video go watch my old stuff subscribe peace What's good, YouTube? Good morning, good morning. Uh, I'm actually outside of my job right now. Let me show y'all. So this is the outside of the club that I manage. Let me see if I can give y'all some zoom action. So yeah, this is the LA Fitness uh, that I work at. Uh, I'm the manager out here at this location. Um, I really like it, it's pretty cool. But um, I just had my morning coffee and I normally don't drink coffee first thing in the morning but I'm tired I'm tired as heck and uh, let's just say I got a little ratchet outside <laughs> somewhere in our neighborhood last night that kept me up a little bit so having me a coffee I'm gonna have a breakfast shake and then I'm gonna go ahead and head into work probably like about 25 minutes early and then I'll make sure everything is good to go uh, so when people start coming in first thing in the morning we're straight but the deal for today is Got work from eight to five, and then afterwards I'm gonna train. I'm actually gonna be switching to a push pull leg split, only because the whole um, bro split, like it's cool, but my body just gets it gets really routine for me, and so I'm gonna get on a push pull leg routine. It's gonna give me some some variety, and it's actually gonna like give me some more experience in like other training splits. So I'm gonna try that out, see how it works for me. And then I'm gonna go home. I've meal prep for this week already, so I got work all the way from today, which is Saturday all the way up until next Thursday and then it's off to San Antonio. So we'll probably be training in San Antonio uh, next weekend at LA Fitness out there. But, oh, so tired. But I'm about to go ahead and go into work, man. Look at him. Look at him, we're not open yet, guys. But that's it, you guys. I'm about to go ahead and down this and then go ahead and to work. I will see y'all later on. Peace. So I had a front pull down to start off. So I started out with a plate, moved up to a plate 25. Added a 10, I moved up to two plates. And I finished off there. So uh, what I'm working on right now is bent over wide grip row. So this machine right here I love because of these things. These things right here are freaking monster. So I'm actually gonna do six working sets on this right here. And then we're gonna move on to uh, my next exercise. But remember to go ahead and like the video. Uh, subscribe if you're new to my channel. I can't say that enough. That's my last time saying it. I'm gonna say it one more time in my outro, but uh, let me know what you guys think. I'm gonna work out so far. I think my progress is coming on fairly well. As you can see, I'm starting to beef up now that my diet is back on point. So your boy's gonna be back on it very, very soon. But I'm gonna go ahead and knock out my two sets here, and then I'll see y'all guys in the next clip. Alright y'all, so um, I'm finishing up 
well not finishing up but I'm actually knocking out some bent over dumbbell rows so the reason why I like doing these is because it's more isolated movement so I get more of a stretch and I can engage uh, and get a tighter squeeze in my back so I'm gonna knock uh, one more set of these out I'm gonna move into final machine work I think I'm gonna do um, regular seated rows so I'm gonna get on the machine do seated rows and then I'm probably gonna get on the rear delt fly machine. So I always hit rear delts whenever I hit back just because I think it's a nice accessory movement because whenever you're building a strong back, you want to make sure that, one, you want to make sure you develop all three heads of your deltoids. But the rear deltoid is probably the most important part, especially whenever you're training back because you want that nice Christmas tree um, look. But I'm going to go ahead and finish off with that. Uh, if you guys have any questions in regards to my workout or any feedback, leave it in the comment section, but don't be a hater. Um, and I'll get it y'all in the next clip. So we're on lap pull downs right now. I'm gonna knock out four working sets and then I'm gonna move into rear delt flies. And I think I think that's, that's actually gonna finish me up for today's back workout. I'm gonna, gonna go ahead and get home before it starts getting dark. 40 minute drive. But um, I will talk to you guys about the rest of the workout and about my new split once I get home. I'm gonna have my final meal that I'll give it to y'all in a second. So remember to like, comment, subscribe, share the video, leave some feedback. I'll get y'all later. workout is done so I just showed you guys what I do for um, my back exercise back is probably like my favorite thing to train I don't know why I just really want a wide back and I really want to build up my quad so uh, my typically any of my exercises on uh, anything that I do I always have an alternate exercise that I can always do so my back days my arm days shoulders shoulders are probably pretty much routine but anything else I pretty much switch it up but um, that's about it I am Going to go ahead and head home now. Gonna go ahead and have my final meal of today, and then I'll probably have like a protein shake or something like that to finish it off. But I wanna to talk to you guys about this new workout split, um, what I'm gonna be doing for YouTube now, and kind of going forward. So I'll see y'all at the house in the magic editing in three, two, one. Grab the scale. We're gonna have 225 grams of this white basmati rice and the rest of this ground turkey. Don't think I have any veggies in here, yo. My pops be wildin'. Look like at the macros on this ice cream while we're here. Uh, 10 fat, 27 carb, 3 protein. Uh, I'm gonna let him keep that. Gonna steam some veggies. Gonna read the label on how to cook them. No, I'm not. You guys know the vibes. About to smash dinner. All right, guys, so I'm actually gonna finish the video in the kitchen because the lighting is horrendous in my room. What is that? By the way, if you're a photographer or a videographer, do not wipe your camera lens with your shirt. But I'm planning on replacing this camera lens soon. Preferably, well, not soon, soon, but like soon. But the reason why I'm changing up my training split is because I want to try something new. I've been training effectively for about a year and a half now, which is where most of my progress has come from. And then the year and a half before that, it really was just a lot of supplements, a lot of dirty bulking, a lot of ego lifting and heavy lifting. And I really just got lucky because I was actually at my heaviest, but I knew nothing about nutrition, knew nothing about like science or anything like that. So now I'm on a better half of the stick. So why I'm moving to a push pull leg split because I want a little bit more variety in my training plan. Uh, I normally stick with the bro split just because I'm comfortable with it and I think I mean, I think it works best for me in terms of some things, but now I think I'm just getting a little bit routine in my training and I want to switch things up. Giving me something new, something new to look at, something new to do inside of the gym. So I'm hoping to implement that on top of my nutrition. So I'm going to be going back to maintenance. Right now I'm eating a little bit above maintenance just because I fell off for a little bit and it's very hard for me to start back eating that much food. So anytime you take a long break, um, from your regimen period, it's gonna take some time to recover and get back to where you were. So that's really where I'm at now. I'm gonna finish off this meal, and I already told you guys, well, yesterday I was supposed to eat it, but I couldn't. I'm gonna have this for dessert. So I'm gonna have this bunk cake, 
for dessert this is about an extra 300 calories now i do not recommend this for all people um really i'm only doing this just because it's just been like one of those weeks where i just kind of like pig out it's still the weekend technically it's sunday so on sundays and saturdays i tend to pick out a little bit i normally grab like some brownies or something to eat that i normally wouldn't eat during the week so uh, with that being said man i have more videos coming i want to start uploading at least twice a week but i'm going to start with once a week let me know what you guys think in the comment section do you guys want me to upload once a week or twice a week i would like more frequency but honestly i just feel like i'd rather put out more quality vlogs than just to put out uh, some random stuff just to say i posted a video so with that being said man i'll talk to you guys later i'm gonna finish this food and then i'm gonna do some editing and finish watching youtube but um leave some love in the comment section like the video subscribe if you're new to my channel if you guys have any questions for me especially my hard gainers or those who are just getting into fitness if you have any questions about supplementation diet nutrition training splits all that type of stuff get at me at la underscore on instagram and i'll see y'all later god bless